Hey guys, welcome to the Scooby Tube channel. I am Ali and I'll be back again with a different video. Today I want to tell you how to repair the charging port, uh, charging issue on the Samsung phones. Uh, right now you see the three different charging issue. Uh, I explained about the, this one. The first one, when only see the warning sign, that's mean phone detection the dust or dust inside the charging port connector. And second one, uh, phone detection the liquid inside the charging port connector. And third one, temperature issue. The third one is completely different and I hope uh, make the uh, video on the future. Today, excellent about the two of three uh, issue, charging issue, dust and liquid. Uh, let me show you on the video. You see when it's connected charging port cable, uh, when his phone is on, uh, pops up the message and said unplug the charger and uh, clean or dry the inside the charging port connector. Now I want to tell you how to fix the, this issue. The first, before uh, explain about the main issue, need to be, we check the few important things. The first. Uh, need be sure uh, NFC or wireless cable, uh, wireless pad connected to the phone or not. If it's not connected, have a charging issue. And second, on the NFC and wireless pad have a small resistor. You need to check the resistor. If it's loose or liquid damage or uh, something happened in, in there, again have a charging issue. And some models have a fingerprint. If it's not connected to the main board, may have a charging issue. This from the main board. Now come to the second side, sub board. The first need to be checked the liquid damage inside the sub board or not. If it's have, need to be cleaned properly. Uh, and second one, you see the uh, charging port connector. Sometimes liquid going under the charging port connector and need to be remove the connector, clean and rebolt the pins and again put back the connector. If we solve the issue, that's fine. But if it's not, now I explain about the main issue. Main issue come from the two lines, two lanes, uh, CC1 and CC2 channel configuration 1 and channel configuration 2 channel configuration uh, detection the accessories uh, like the headphone OTG cable or any gadget and second uh, detect the direction of cable you know uh, when you want to put the type C uh, because type C have a uh, we can use the uh, type C from double side for that reason channel uh, configuration have a two lens or two pins for uh, detect the direction of cable now we know about the this this lane and now uh, we go to the main issue Main issue usually come from the two diodes you can see on the photo. If it's damaged, loose, or something happen on the one of the diodes, we have a this issue. That means when end of the checking, when is uh, NFC wireless pad is okay, resistor on the wireless pad is okay. Uh, if it's you sure is fingerprints connected and the subboard doesn't have any liquid and remove the connector and reboil the pins uh, if it's all is okay uh, end of the diagnosis need be replaced and put the new diodes now we have a problem for uh, find the diodes if you on the shop have a broken iPhone screen you can find the diodes on the uh, flex uh, cable uh, uh, LCD just need be remove the shield and uh, take the two diodes from there keep it and 
when have a, like this issue you can use the dead tiles in there and fix the uh, this to issue dust and liquid damage i hope this video helped to you thank you for watching awaiting your suggestion and if you have any question you can uh, put it under the video and uh, thank you for watching and see you next video